The Society of Chemical Industry is a learned society set up in 1881, "...to further the application of chemistry and related sciences for the public benefit." Its purpose is, "...promoting the commercial application of science for the benefit of society," and provides an international forum where science meets business on independent, impartial ground. Since being founded in 1881, the society has expanded and diversified to cover a range of interest areas, such as food and agriculture, pharmaceuticals, biotechnology, environmental science and safety. Offices The headquarters is in Belgrave Square, London. In addition there are semi-independent branches in the United States, Canada, and Australia. Aims The society aims to promote links between scientists and industrialists, and does so through technical and business interest groups and international and regional groups, and by running some 50 conferences, seminars and lectures a year. SCI also aims to inform government decision-making relating to science and industry. A paper urging further action on science education to protect the future of UK economic health produced by SCI members in response to the closure of the chemistry department at the University of Sussex gained newspaper coverage in the UK. History On 21 November 1879, Lancashire chemist John Hargreaves canvassed a meeting of chemists and managers in Widnes, St Helens and Runcorn to consider the formation of a chemical society. Modelled on the successful Tyne Chemical Society already operating in Newcastle, the newly proposed South Lancashire Chemical Society held its first meeting on 29 January 1880 in Liverpool, with the eminent industrial chemist and soda manufacturer Ludwig Mond presiding. It was quickly decided that the society should not be limited to just the local region and the title the Society of Chemical Industry was finally settled upon at a meeting in London on 4 April 1881, as being more inclusive. Held at the offices of the Chemical Society, now the headquarters of the Royal Society of Chemistry, in Burlington House, this meeting was presided over by Henry Roscoe, appointed first president of SCI, and attended by Eustace Carey, Ludwig Mond, F. A. Abel, Lothian Bell, William H. Perkin, Walter Weldon, Edward Ryder Cook, Thomas Tyra and George E. Davis, all prominent scientists, industrialists and MPs of the time. Membership The original membership fee was very steep for the time, the first subscription fee was set at one guinea, which would be equivalent to nearly £400 today. Four grades of membership were agreed at the time, member, associate, student and honorary, with most appointments made on the basis of a review of their eligibility by the Psi Council. Despite the high fee, by the time of the first official meeting of the Society of Chemical Industry in June 1881, it had attracted over 300 members. Incorporation An extraordinary general meeting was held on 27 March 1906, under the direction of President Edward Divers and Secretary C. G. Cresswell, to discuss a motion to apply for incorporation under a royal charter. The resolution was formally proposed by Sir Thomas Boverton Redwood. After some discussion, the motion was unanimously supported. The Society was formally incorporated, by Royal Charter, as of 17 June 1907, and its bylaws were published in the Journal of the Society of Chemical Industry. By that time, it had expanded to include a number of satellite chapters, including Canada, New South Wales, New York and New England as well as locations within Great Britain. <laughs> Headquarters. The first headquarters of the newly fledged Society of Chemical Industry was established in 1881 at Palace Chambers, Bridge Street, Westminster, London. 
After a series of changes of address, the Society finally moved to its fifth and present location at 14 15ths and initially 16 Belgrave Square in 1955. Owned by the Duke of Westminster, along with the rest of Belgravia, the building was and still is part of the Grosvenor estate and had recently been commandeered by the Ministry of Defence during World War II. The former Nazi commander Rudolf Hess is believed to have been interrogated in the building after he flew to Britain late in the war. Events <inaudible> 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 SAI organizes over 50 conferences and events per year which are focused around stimulating and informative scientific and special interest subjects. These are primarily organized through SAI member-led technical and regional interest groups. SAI runs free public evening lectures, as well as several awards programs designed to raise awareness of the benefits of the practical application of chemistry and related sciences across scientific disciplines and industrial sectors. The SAI also confers scholarships and travel bursaries to student members, and celebrates accomplished scientists, educators and business people through a number of international awards, medals, and lectureships. <laughs> Technical interest groups SAI has a number of technical interest and business interest groups, which aim to provide opportunities to exchange ideas and gain new perspectives on markets, technologies, strategies and people. These groups over a wide range of topics and regions, with some being more active than others. SCI's technical interest groups comprise Agrosciences Biotechnology The British Carbon Group Colloid and surface chemistry Construction materials Electrochemical technology Environment Fine chemicals Fire and materials chemistry Food group Health, safety and environment Horticulture Lipids Macro Group UK Materials chemistry Process engineering Science and enterprise Separation science and technology Young chemists panel International groups International groups comprise Society of Chemical Industry American section Australia Canada Regional interest groups Regional interest groups in the UK comprise All Ireland Bristol and South West Cambridge and Great Eastern Chinese UK Liverpool and North West London Scotland Thames and Kennet Yorkshire and the Humber East Midlands. Topic journals The Society publishes a number of peer-reviewed scientific journals in conjunction with John Wiley and Sons, Biofuels, Bioproducts and Biorefining Energy Science and Engineering Greenhouse Gases, Science and Technology Journal of Chemical Technology and Biotechnology Journal of the Science of Food and Agriculture Pest Management Science Polymer International Topic chemistry and industry Sci also publishes the monthly magazine Chemistry and Industry. Topic <laughs> Awards. The society gives a number of awards, including the Levenstein Memorial Award to persons who have made significant contributions in the field of chemical technology.